Hi guys, so you know that if you follow my channel or even if you don't, um, one thing that I do all the time is I share with you videos quite often by Grendel61. Now, he's out there fighting this ridiculous corruption that's going on locally uh, over in California where uh, him and some others are going out and exposing um, this corruption that's uh, going on in um, these local officials over in California. Uh, those of you that don't follow my channel and don't keep up with me, um, I am from Texas. Okay. And I just wanted to uh, expose something that maybe uh, people of y'all, uh, some of y'all people in the other parts of the world um, haven't heard about. Uh, this has been an ongoing issue in Texas for quite some time now. I, I'm going to, I'm going to, I can't even, you, I can't even find the words to describe how ridiculous, how ridiculous our elected officials are in Dallas-Fort Worth. This right here sums up politics in Dallas for maybe about the past 10, 15 years. And this may be the most ridiculous and most corrupt part of the government in the country. And I won't even talk about how it absolutely has to be the mo possibly the most controversial and ridiculous elected official that we have in this area. I'm going to show you a clip right here and uh this is a clip of the current and uh dallas county commissioner and his opponent and this is a clip that somebody recorded from their phone last night these are the two opponents running for dallas county commissioner's office right and i'm going to show you what this vi what this video happened from last night As a mom, you will do anything for your child. Stopping their pain. But what about the times when you don't know what to do? That's why Children's Health is here. Sorry guys, you gotta bear with me. I don't feel like going through the trouble of editing out this, this ad. For orthopedics and sports medicine. Just like you are always by their side, we're Children's Health. And we're by your side. Two candidates for county commissioner in a near fist fight. It happened during a debate, and now days before voters hit the polls, we're learning new details about what may have led to the flare-up. CBS 11's Jennifer Lindgren joins us now live from Dallas with more on this story. Jen. Well, Karen, we are just one week away from primary voting day, and now two candidates, prominent candidates, vying for a seat here at the Dallas County Commissioner's Court are finding themselves in the spotlight this morning after what was caught on camera at a gospel radio station on Monday. Now, in this cell phone video taken during a candidate forum at Heaven 97, Dwayne Carraway can be heard yelling at John Wiley Price. Witnesses say it started when words were exchanged during a commercial break. Others in the room had to separate the two, and Dallas police were called to the radio station. Micah Phillips is another candidate who was in the room. He took this video and says the drama and language was inexcusable. His character is to be questioned after this video is heard. And we've been unable to reach a price for comment. Dwayne Carraway says he has other videos that paint what happened in a totally different light. He says he plans to release those clips to the public today. Live in Dallas, Jennifer Lindgren, CBS. So let me, before I get into this, but let's just point out here 
they're at a gospel radio station. All right, you see the KHBN Heaven, right? This is a Christian radio station where these two gentlemen running for Dallas County Commissioner start cussing each other out and almost have a fight. It looks like it's the uh, one of those things for, you know how you see the boxing matches and before, and they're sitting there talking trash to each other and a fight's about to break out. Welcome to Dallas City Council. Right? Like, this is something that's been going on in Dallas for years. Uh, I'm currently in San Antonio. I plan on moving back um, to the Dallas-Fort Worth area uh, in the very near future, the next few weeks here. All right? And when I get out there, I'm just giving y'all an update that I'm going to start attending some of these meetings. And I'm going to start keeping track of some of the stuff that's going on there because it doesn't seem like anybody is. And if there is, I haven't seen anything about it. But this has been going on for years. Um, let me see if I can find this over here real quick. Uh, no, hold on. And uh, John Wiley Price is the current uh, Dallas County Commissioner. He has been in office for years I have absolutely no idea how this man keeps getting elected to office let me show you a clip of how uh, what a good uh, elected official this man is have a look right here That's right. In case you didn't totally hear that, I'm going to make sure that you understood what he said. He said, you are all white, so you can all go to hell. And that basically is offering to, uh, because they can't uh, uh, curse or yell and act like an idiot in the courtroom, he's basically inviting these people to go outside to fight like they're in middle school. And this has been going on in Dallas, I would say for 10 years. I don't remember how many years, it, how many years ago it was now. And I am amazed because I've actually looked for stories on this on YouTube and on the internet. Maybe one of you can go and look for yourselves and find the story. I was actually present in Dallas when John Wiley Price was out leading a group, a small group of people through Dallas, uh, telling them to kill all white people. All right, I am not making this up. And somehow, some way, this man keeps getting elected into office. You must be surprised as I am because I would have think that most people in America would think of the racist people in Texas looking like some crusty old white cowboy, when the reality is the real face of racism in Texas looks more like this man. So this is what your Dallas County uh, City Council is doing with this man. Somehow Dallas keeps electing this man into office. He is currently under investigation for multiple charges on top of that. And you can see multiple clips, if you go look on YouTube at John Wiley Price, of this man screaming, yelling, banging a table, screaming and, and intimidating people, and cursing 
uh, white people. So this is the face of racism in Texas. A lot of you may have thought that it was some white person, but it's not. Don't get me wrong. I'm sure we've got plenty of those here too. But this man, he's just a whole nother thing. So this is uh this is your uh, this is your state government at work, people. And I want everybody in America to get out there and expose this man. Y'all need to share this video and let people know what's been going on in Dallas for years. This man is a despicable human being. And I don't know how in the hell this man keeps getting elected into office. But somehow he does, and somehow he keeps doing the same things that he does, and somehow he's still getting votes. The only thing that I can think is that people just aren't interested enough in what's going on in their city to actually get out and vote. I think most people are still just like, well, I'm going to go out and vote for president, and that's it. And somehow, idiots like this keep getting into office. So, I just wanted to show you what's going on in the race for a county commissioner in Dallas and let you know what this man has been doing for the past seven years. And if you want a good laugh, go look up some videos on this man and see the ridiculous things that he has done. It is absolutely insane. So, I just wanted to point this out to you guys, and I want America to start exposing this man because this kind of behavior happening with our elected officials in this country needs to stop and it needs to be exposed. That's it. I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you for watching.